He can still feel the heat. A little bit. It's not like ice cold or anything. Get to go mow grass again. I guess the pastures do need mowed. Man, they really got out of control. A little, just a little bit though, not a whole lot. Okay, so I started to kind of think about how to unhook everything. And you got everything such a, such a mess with all these wires and I think, yeah, this, well then what do we do about this stupid thing here? Let's see, this wire runs, then this gets its power right there at that blank switch. Uh, yeah, me and wires don't get along the greatest. <laughs> I don't know why we wouldn't use the 3010 to, to pull that mower home with. Unless you don't like the idea of screwing around and hooking the mower to put the wagons away to hook the mower back up anyways. Well, it's just as much dorking around uh, Take another tractor down there, get the mower, get this tractor, go back down, put wagons away, close up. It's like, uh, not how I wanted to start the day. Unless he thinks there's nowhere level to unhook the mower, which that could very well be. I can guarantee you I might lose this frickin' thing. What up? I don't care. I really don't care no more. Mm, God damn is that son of a bitch heavy. So I'm a little perturbed right now. A little bit unhappy. Um, because... I want to be able to do more things. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Get the fuck out of the dirt. But I can't because I'm dumb, stupid, and retarded. Like a lot of people say. Um, the one thing that I hate about this mower is that PTO shaft. Now, I'll show you when we get up there and we get it hooked up to the other tractor. But, yeah, I know what you guys really think of me. Don't be afraid to call me, call, say it to my face. You won't hurt my feelings. I don't, I don't care no more. I really don't. So I got all that crap put back where it goes. Won't be needing them things for wheat or, no, for oats. Oats will be needing them. He's wanting to keep oats. So I think I'm getting everything figured out. I I don't know. The tablet stays in here. That charger stays with that tablet. That internet box stays in here. This thing gets the heck out of here. I don't know where to put it for the time being. So I don't... I think this thing comes out of here. I'll find it. Just put it right there. For the time being. Come down here and wonder why the heck New Holland had to invent 
so long wires when all you really needed was to go from here up to there you don't need a thousand foot just to do i mean look at this this is this is a bit overkill isn't it i mean who in their right mind would have that long of a tractor that you would need this much wire this I don't get it. I just, I don't get it. Why? Why do you need a thousand foot just when you're going, you know, two foot? Or, you guys know what I mean. I'm tired of explaining myself to people that don't get it, but whatever. It is what it is. This is why me and Electric do not get along for this simple reason that I know where this wire goes and I'm not too happy about messing with it. Um, you can either hook it here, right here where there's a bunch of tape and a stupid connector. You get a wire. So that's for that Stupid internet box. This one. Then got this one that goes back down here underneath this crap. And I bet you that probably goes to the battery. And you probably get rid of the connection down there to Baylor. I don't know. This is this is just a rat's nest to me. It... <sighs> why god why? <sighs> so I think I got everything unhooked. This goes in here, I think. So I guess the only thing to do... see if I can get hooked up to that mower I guess now to wrestle with that stupid thing yeah yeah okay let me get some gloves real quick yay this is gonna be fun Not really. This is why I hate doing this kind of stuff. Because I missed the old mower and it had a slide and a handle. It had a slide that was welded and it came up to about here and this thing slid back and forth on it, allowing the uh, allowing you just to be able to slide the shaft and then I have to pick it up and then try and slide it like you have to do now with this dumb thing which I don't understand why they had to make this stupid thing why they had to make this stupid thing so that going heavy in the first place you don't need it Damn. 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 
turn the metal. This is actually a two-person job because you cannot you cannot turn this end and turn or line this end up. I mean, it's turn the blades at the same fucking time. But I'll say, not as heavy as that disc bar. That, that shaft there, that shaft there is about that big around all the way back. Now are they hooked up right? Let's see. Middle one should be up and down. The two outside ones should be the wings. Oh, I got, how did I get them right? Huh. I did get them right. Wow. First try. Wow, I am really happy. Now to flip the locks down. Oh, come on, what the heck happened here? That one didn't want to, didn't want to cooperate. Mm. I probably went the wrong way with the hydraulic. Yep, that's what it was. So I forgot that the bottom remote drifts off and that is exactly what this thing is doing. Uh, it's drifting off. Uh, so therefore, I cannot use the bottom set with uh, the wings. I got to use bottom remote for up and down because it wants to go down just like it did now. And uh, the wings, it don't really matter on them. I need the power up to lock the cylinders. And as soon as I get out of the tractor, it starts drifting. But... I got it figured out. So I should have got started about three hours ago, 6.30 or so. Uh, it is now 8, 9 o'clock. Um, but instead I kept making excuses as to why I couldn't hook this up. And I was like, you know what, screw it. So I just got down with it and unhooked the baler. And it took a lot of time, yes, but I got it unhooked. Got this thing hooked up as you guys seen, and uh, we're gonna go mow. Thanks for watching guys, see you next time.